Hello and welcome back to Fire Emblem 7. Um, we are Fifth. on chapter 13, I believe, so... Also, can we applaud the Skip usage that. of original places? Yeah. Like, the names are pretty great. Santa Cruz sounds like a real place. Santa Cruz. Yeah, like I said, we're gonna have to speak up a little bit just because, um... Just the mic's, like, gotta... It has limiters, so... It has a big gay. This is called the worst chapter in the game. Um, it's, it's Fog of War, which means you can only see things if your units are in range. Oh, I... Alright, so... Yeah. This was the first one where I legitimately had a game over. Fire Emblem. Lowen makes this bearable. Um... Looking low and I remember the strategy correctly. You can basically slap guy right here. Uh, friggin' axe units will spam out of these forts just constantly. So we're gonna. So you could just level guy. Have to take that guy. Okay, I'm I'm gonna try to use guy. I know he's a sword master or a Miramadon, which is kind of bad. But um, see, you know what that's it's when like you know you have an issue when a Miramadon is bad. Well, they're not good. Swords are only able to do one to two range, so. Oh, or not one that the swords aren't able to do one. Wait, who range. are you protecting? Linus. He has, um, <laughs> one, 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 wow, wonderful stats here. I'm stumbling on my words he today. He has 12 blocks, so I mean, a lot of avoid. But it's just, I don't know. Literally everything else is terrible. So luckily, since Loan is a beast, he's gonna be very helpful. So. Hit 40, man. Axe users freaking suck. They do. Wow, he got a level up out of that. Really hope he can continue the good luck streak. That's good enough. Yes. Didn't get defense. This is the first level he's ever gotten that didn't have defense, but these stats are beautiful. So. He has no rest whatsoever, so basically if he gets hit with any uses rest, he's gonna freaking die. Well, you imply that mages exist. Yeah, you're right. Um. Also, I know I know you, like, crap on Hector a lot. I do not crap on no, Hector. No, not Hector. Um, Orcus. But he is, like, the only axe unit up to, like, 10. Like, I think chapter 10 in Lin mode. Let me... And he freaking yeah. storms through people okay. in Lin mode. Take a good look at his stats, right? Okay. All mm -hmm. right. Cool. All right. Take a good look at his <laughs> stats. <laughs> Not a comparison. I don't get Hector. <laughs> well, Hector's too good. <laughs> what is it? Frick you, Hector. He had 71 hit on there. No damage, though. All right. Well, we're going to have to do the unthinkable. Use Rebe We can't even use it. Get out of the way, Merlinus. Oh yeah, you can rescue green units, which are... That's kind of OP. Maybe Rebecca will get a good level up. We don't know. <laughs> Impossible. Or maybe she won't get one. Also, um, what's his name? Buddy? Um, no, the horseback <laughs> rider archer that you get in loon mode. Uh, Wrath? Wrath is freaking awesome. Alright, so Dorcas and Bartray have the very noble, um, thing here. Uh, stand next to Merlinus and make sure he doesn't get hit that much, so... <laughs> See, oh, we need to give this to Matthew. Um, this is the only chapter in normal mode that I'll ever use Marcus on, really, just because there's no point in using it. Um, oh man, I sure do love seeing things. Well, there... <laughs> I at least know where enemies are, which is nice. Oh, crap. So... At least Ellie Wood has defense, I guess. It doesn't really have any speed or anything useful. A bit useful, you know. Well, Ellie Wood's not turning out too well. I'm not gonna lie. I have uh, this game, and I've been playing it a little bit. And what I've figured out so far is that if you can double, you're basically a god. That's honestly true. Speed is probably the most important stat in this game. I remember. I already told you this story, but I'm gonna tell it for the YouTube watchers. There was a, a level, and if you've ever played this game, it's one where you have to go, like, down this, like, incredibly narrow path, and it's just a bottleneck. I ended up flanking with my Florina and just XP farming on these two, um, these two fortresses, and she would double nine everything. And after a, uh, ever... Eh. After every, like, um, wave, I would just give her a vulnerary. I don't know how to kill this guy. <laughs> we we actually lack the means to kill this guy that aren't Oswin, so. Also, some... I just want to point this out. Oh my god. <laughs> Hector takes no damage. Um I would just set I would just set him there and I wanna watch try this, this for the meme. I don't expect this to hit. Bonk. Okay. Thank you, Hector. Is it a sin to like Dorcas's animation a bit more? 
where he just walks up and slaps the guy in the face with yeah. an axe. Yeah. I think it's funny. So now I'm actually going to use Ellie Wood here to put that on Hector. Well, you can do that. Yeah, you can. It's, it's Braid Equipping, I think, is the official name. Probably not. What is it? What up? And again, we have to use some units here just because none of the ones you get at this point in the game are. Honestly. Um, what, what's the guy's name? What's the guy's name in Lin mode? The first armor you need to get. Um. Looks um, like it took a bowling ball to assess. Wallace? I hate the fact that when he gets introduced, you're forced to use the, uh. Not in Lin hard mode. You can actually save that. I hate that you're forced to use it because I was going to use it with one of the Cavaliers and, like, yeah. level, the, level them up because they're already nuts as they are. And they have movement, and they can do stuff. <laughs> so that actually is, in Lin hard mode, if you're planning on playing Hector hard mode, sorry for my cursor there, I'm trying to make it disappear. Um, in Lin hard mode, you have to play that to play Hector hard mode correctly. Like, it, it's almost impossible to do without. Uh, people will play through only with Sane or Kent. They'll let them get all of the kills and then promote them at the end of the chapter because you don't have to use the Nightcrest. Um, so then you basically, instead of Marcus as your Dagon for, like, a while, you get Saner Kent. It's very helpful, and it's actually really fun to do. By they already points. kick butt. Yeah, Rebecca's weak, but we'll at least get her some experience. Let's see what level she gets, and if I ever want to use her again because of it. See, as far as I can tell, bow units are mostly just for- Oh my, oh my god. Okay, Rebecca, you might- you might see some action here. As far as I can <laughs> tell, most bow units are just chip damage and nothing beyond that. Eh, uh, it's, it's really hard for me to say that that's false. The only one that for I found you. that's, like, objectively really good is, um, um, the one guy. The one, oh yeah. Because he, because he's a horseback rider. And he comes with the short bow, which does less damage, but it has more, I think, I think it has a higher crit rate. No. But once you give him an iron bow, he just becomes a force to be reckoned with. So, oh, Hector level. Really, please get a good Hector. Please get a good level Hector. Ah, oh, that works. That's fine. He got defense and strength. He needs speed. Oh, yeah. Also, 15 rate. Uh, nope. This is why you just let Guy deal with this section, because um, I think that's actually the highest hit rate guy in the entire fortress. Nope, the 17 probably is. Oh, dear. Yeah. He's just Silver Chariot. <laughs> Basic. Oh, you need to see the um the crit animation for the Swordmaster. It's it's is, one of the best. Is it the same animation. as Lin's? No, it's it's kind of the same in spirit, but it's like more spastic even. Because I got Lin's for the first time using the uh, Manny Caddy. Yeah. And the Manny Caddy has a one in four chance of critting, so I mean nothing <laughs> special there. Yeah, you, you it, just kind of basically with the, that. It's basically a big middle finger to the entire enemy team. <laughs> Okay, we're actually gonna have Hector advance with the rest of this. Matthew, how do, you, how do you get your armor unit to move so fast? Is my question. What do you mean? Because the armor units always move incredibly slowly. Oh, um, it's really dumb that you have to have the prerequisite, but once you beat the game, you can hold down A to make everything speed up. That's Matthew, nice Matthew, Matthew. See, as far as I can tell, the most balanced game that I've played is, and I'm probably gonna make a lot of people angry by saying this, is Fire Emblem Awakening. Because I used it. The only one that was kind of bad were, um, the Beast you. Um. It's true, though. The dragons weren't too bad, because they could tank quite a bit of damage. Um, but it's god-awful trying to level them up to get to that point. It really is, honestly. Um, if I remember, most of my kills were gotten from Bake and Longku, because I paired them up. Um, and they just got most of the kills in the entire story mode. And I remember I had... For some reason, I made Stahl a, a thief. <laughs> okay. No. Interesting choice. Wait, what's, what's the thing that you can promote out of thief? Assassin or trickster. Assassin. That's what I made him. I made him an assassin when I gave him a Weirm Slayer for like no reason other than it looked cool. And he did, and he did decent damage. What the frick? Why does he heal? 
Um, oh, I remember really Vacan Long who just cr either crit or did like unholy damage to literally everyone that came in five feet of them. <laughs> yeah. Oh, a guy might level up. This is good. Yeah, like I said, it's ri oh. <laughs> Rip this guy in general. Accidental strategy. <laughs> I, I love armor units. How like like no one does any damage. Should they just clink weapons off of them and just like? They're beefy oh, freaking. Shoot. <laughs> oh god. Okay, that's not good. Okay, we're gonna have to deal with that guy first. I completely forgot that there was one of. Oh. Ah, uh, they only do. Are they ever crit? Ah, but they might double. I was really hoping that- we'll, we'll look at the speed difference here. Okay. This guy has five speed. Never mind. It's, it's later in the game that these guys get ridiculous stats. I would just shoot him with who you have there and then... So, if we get this village, we get something useful. That I've only let one village be destroyed, and I think it was the one where you have... It was in Lin mode, because I haven't gotten past Lin mode yet. But it was <laughs> the level where they have the... Uh, Ballista? Oh, yeah, that's an annoying one. Well, here, the Ballista never hit any of my guys. What the frick, Oswin? Why did you only level res? What kind of growth rate is that? So, I don't know why the Ballista is, like, so annoying, because as long as I kept, um, I just kept Florna out of the range for it, because she can fly past the range if you position her right in a single turn. And then, after that, I just killed the guy... None of my units ever got hit in the journey to actually kill him. Oh, hey, cool tidbit here. So thieves can see really well in darkness, so we can move them up here, and there's actually no... Oh, that's right. And uh, there is the boss guy that's right here. Oswin can basically wreck him, so I'm not too concerned about that. Wreck him. Okay. Just do that. 69. The problem is... He's what's on his, the forest. What's We're his gonna... hit rate? Uh, too high is what it is. No, no, no. What's um, guys hit rate with the uh, killing edge? Too low is what it is. Uh, fifth or sixty-nine. So do it. I, I want to. This guy is on the forest. I'm going to get him off. Guy can easily take one hit from that. So I would risk it for. The Oh, gee. Risk but, it for the pastry. Okay, the boss unit on this level is, like, legitimately bonkers. It's, he's impossible to kill, uh, unless you're using Marcus and... So, are the, uh... So, I know it says the thing is save the one green guy, but... Seven if turns. You, if, if you just, like, kill everyone before that, does it just give you it anyway? No. It's a really weird quirk that it's, like, even if everyone else is dead, it'll still make you just in turn for, like, that's okay. So, guy, guy at least likes to dodge at the very least. Kind of interesting that that actually. So we'll oh have to use the kill. Oh my god! Well, so much for that guy. <laughs> so much idiot! Oh, he got strength. Okay, strength. guy and Rebecca, I'm gonna try to use because um, they actually are getting good growth. So. Well, you just attack it. Wait, you shoot. can attack it? No, no, not the village. The guy oh, had a no, javelin. Oh, no, he had a javelin. Also, they just give me all the money in the village. Jesus. 5,000 gold. Thank you. So. Um. Well. I love how, I love how the bandits basically just look like JoJo's because they're jacked. Yeah. <laughs> they just, look like Jonathan Joestar. They kind of do. Guy has crappy mood in there, so... Good. That might be Aiden. Thank you, Dexter, for letting us yeah. know. I doubt that's picking up the mic, but if it is, that is Dalton's dog. Aiden calls it Daxter. I have limiters on here, so if the audio ends up getting screwed up really badly, I do apologize. Okay, this is the boss. His stats are really good for this point in the game. Mercenary. It's just his speed and strength, plus he has one of these, so it's, like, kind of terrifying. Um, also, Axe Breakers. What is Axe Breakers? I think it's a oh, frick, spear. Oh, frick, I Spear you can get. And so those just, do those just, like, reverse the weapon triangle? Yeah, I forgot, okay. It's He's kind dead. of embarrassing that I'm forgetting some of the meta here. Owen's not gotten hit once, that's impressive. 
that good, as per usual. <laughs> hey, look, the nerd's here. What's up, gamer? Hey, Aiden is here. Ooh, Fear. <laughs> Alright, I'm gonna change in my new jeans. Okay! So, that's, that. that's a nice shirt. Thank you. My, uh, diamond is number <laughs> This is a diamond, holy cow. Nice. Anyway, back to Fire Emblem. Here. Um, Guy Fire Emblem. Bella Air. Oh, Lowen can double this guy, thank you. These guys are a pain and a half to deal with because they have the highest range out of any unit in the game. They have the... Oh. Okay. Um. Not through the heart. Do that. <laughs> oh, this guy needs to die, and no one can kill him. So we're gonna back everyone the frick up here. Um. I there remember are a lot of units. The only unit that I've that has been killed and I've left killed is Matthew. That's not good. You need a thief. I know. And I and I accidentally did it, and then I didn't want to reset the chapter because it was on the last turn of the chapter, and I just was like didn't want to, so I let him die. But mainly I let him die only because I knew that Well It was close it was clo I'm like I said, I'm close to the end. He died close to the end. I was gonna laugh if Ellie would could double that guy. It scares me how fast you move your units in the game. Like you should see a video of his fingers all the <laughs> Yeah, well I've I've played this game like a lot. This is probably the game that I have the most playthroughs on out of anything. How many playthroughs in... Uh, I would give it a least. good 15, if not Jeez. more. Um, do this... Yes. Here. Who can level? Elliewood can level. Okay, who's on needs to... who's off. Um, <laughs> we'll just use the Vapier, because effectiveness is funny. Have you ever played Shadow Dragon on the DS? Um, I pl not all of it. I played it on an emulator, and I didn't really like it. I beat, I think I beat it, but I remember it being hell to get through so hard the entire time. Everyone says it's not a very good game, so I. It's not, on that unfortunately. Really. Nice pants. Eight. All right. Nice pants. It's time to late. just make Hector uh think everything. Could there's nothing better to do. He's not gonna be able to fight the sword user over there, so. I would move, uh. Ooh. move Sarah out of where she is. Is she, though? No. Can you not move any? We'll, we'll use this, because. Isn't she, like, the only healer Archer you get horses for a while? Or thing? Yeah, she is. That's why I want to keep her alive. I, I don't think. Okay. In all 15 playthroughs of the game, the only time that I've actually used Sarah was the one that I said, hey, I'm gonna use, like, obscure units like Dorcas and Sarah this game. He is a yes. real character. He's... <laughs> he is this guy. Somebody poisoned my button. <laughs> yeah. So, anyway. His Dorcas wife, memes aside. His wife can't Frick, this is the last turn. Okay, well, we're, we are not going to be, um, killing the boss, because I forgot he spawned his way over there, so... That you did get anything from at all, or...? Yeah, experience. He's pretty jacked in level. He's level 10, so anyone who kills him is bound to level up. So, if you start in Ellawood, you don't... Do, do, all, do all the units cross over from Lin mode? Mm, yeah, I think so. So, why would you start in El... Rick, he doesn't have speed. Something that they did in Banjo-Tooie is, like, they let you skip the tutorial of how to do stuff if you, um, have played the first game. It'll, like, ask you, like, the first game. If so, we they should do that with Lin Mode. Well, I mean, once you beat Lin Mode one time, any other times on the save file, you're allowed to skip it, which is actually why I um chose this specific save file that I had because I already beat Lin a long time ago. Matthew gets hit, I'm gonna be sad. Matthew, <laughs> if you're only going to level speed, at least freaking dodge. Okay, we can at least see every one of the four mile radius. Oh, hi. <laughs> hi there. Hello. Um. Rick, all my units suck. <laughs> Alright, Hector, take us home. 
I want to see. Uh, I want to see Hector's crit animation. Uh, he throws the axe over his shoulder and then. Back. Wait, wait, like, oh, like this. Yeah, he like throws it. <laughs> I, 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 he doesn't I, throw it. I no. expected you to like have him turn around and just throw the axe behind him and bank the shot. Oh, his <laughs> his critical hit for a hand axe is probably one of my favorites in the game, just because it's like so smooth. Yeah. Yeah, if yes. you die. Permadeath. Back. Frick! This is the dodgiest band that ever. The uh, the only thing that the only two games that don't have permadeath, I think, are uh, Fates and Awakening. But yeah, those are casual. Phoenix mode freaking sucks. Why? It's like a story mode at that point. It's like, oh, it's a visual novel. Okay, like, this is. Loan is currently my most powerful unit that's not Marcus. This is how much the bot. The... I'm literally going to have to use Loan in every single one of the thumbnails. <laughs> He's been carrying. I wish we had one more. Matthew! You're the worst unit in the entire game! Okay. You kill him. Yeah, barely. I mean, hey, you got a level. Maybe you can actually get, like, a stat. Well, okay, he'll max out speed, and then I get to get Legault, and not... Oof, blast. <laughs> Oof. <laughs> okay, we save Merlinus, we get him, cool, all things are good in... Oh man, so we made... Are you almost done with this? No. no, there are 30 chapters. Oh, okay, I saw Finale, I was like, whoa. Okay, so, uh, we're actually gonna end it here. Thank you for watching, everyone!